What is going on guys? Today I'll be doing my first service on the 2022 Honda Grom. We'll be changing the filter, uh, cleaning the screen, and changing the oil. It's only got 250 miles on it, but I beat the absolute balls off this thing. So let's hop right on into this. So I'm gonna start it and let it warm up a little bit so the oil drains a little bit faster. All right, so the drain plug is a 12 millimeter socket. Is this one right there? Go ahead and get that one broke loose. Don't forget about the crush washer. It goes on your drain plug. That's what helps seal it. Mine just fell off. I forgot about it. <laughs> it was stuck up on the engine. Don't forget about that. You definitely need that. Next, I'm gonna take this these two bolts out, this is the cover for your oil filter. It's a little eight millimeter. I don't know where my small mallet is. There we go. And then make sure you keep a hold of this spring. Don't let it fall. Screwdriver didn't work, but the pick worked. All right, so next thing I'm gonna do is go ahead and take this case off. There's a screen in there that is before your pickup for your oil pump. I'll show you guys how to clean that. All these case screws are eight millimeter. All right, so I got the side cover off. You definitely got some clutch material there. It's probably from all the wheelies. One thing you gotta be careful with is on the pump here, this, these two uh, dowels, they come out and they have this rubber gasket on it. When I pulled that off, they both fell out and I didn't know where they went, but I figured it out. It goes right here, the little rubber gaskets. This is the screen that I was talking about. And it's definitely got some metal on it and some gasket material. There's some more gasket material laying in there. Now, the way these screens go in, you see how it's tapered? And I'm holding the fat end and the skinny end that way. The skinny end will slide in first. I'm gonna go ahead and clean all this up, clean that crap out of there. All right, so I cleaned the screen, like I said. Skinny end in. Slide that back in. And then real carefully put that cover back on. Whenever you tighten it, you go in a cross pattern and they also need to be torqued. So everything I'm finding for the clutch cover bolts is anywhere from seven to 10 foot pounds. I'm just gonna set it up for nine. Now, nine foot pounds is not a lot. It's just a little past tight. So there's six, seven, eight. I don't even like putting them that tight. I might change it. I might go to eight. Just be super careful not to over tighten these because once you strip them out, you're kind of screwed. Now I opted for this little dinky high flow. So the way these go in is the gasket on the filter. See how that's got a gasket and this side doesn't? The gasket goes in and there's a little like nipple on it. You gotta get it the seat right on it. But before you go doing that, put a little bit of oil on that gasket. All right, I got my oil on it. So I'm gonna just, the spring sits right into that little hole. And then you want the spring to sit on this inside hole too. If your gasket on the outside of this cover is messed up, I'd recommend replacing it. These two bolts, you really have to tighten them up even. So I, I put the cap on, had it like, Halfway started, put the two bolts in, and then literally did like two turns, then two turns, two turns, two. Then it went in super smooth doing it that way. I originally like tried to tighten that half and then tighten that half, and it was not going smooth at all. Don't forget about putting your drain plug back in. So this is the oil we're going to run. 10W30 GN4 Honda oil. It takes exactly one quart, so I just buy a quart. And go ahead and dump it right on in. I just finished changing the oil. I just added it. Time to start it up. So this will be the first oil change it's ever had. So 
Start right up, no problems. I don't see any leaks. All right guys, so that's how you change the oil on a 2022 Grom and that's how you check the um, oil screen. Thanks for watching, I'll catch you guys on the next one.